New at 10 police have confirmed that a gun was found on the campus of a high school in Oakland this morning. Fortunately, though, it did not escalate to violence. And this all happened at Dewey Academy, Oakland Unified School District, and the school itself did not release any details on what happened. KTV's Amber Lee joining us live tonight from Oakland after speaking with parents and a youth football coach about this latest report of guns at schools. Amber? Alex, Christina, parents tell me they're not surprised, but that it does add to their concerns about their children's safety at school. They want more counselors on school campuses to help children cope with problems. Police are investigating what it describes as a firearm incident at Dewey Academy, a high school in Oakland. Officers recovered a gun but did not release details. A student tells me a loaded gun was found in the backpack of another student. A source says no one was arrested and no one was injured. Still, parents say the discovery is disturbing and that it may be a sign of fear among students. Obviously, they're dealing with something. People are scared. They're bringing guns and people that that are just there, they're scared of being shot, are, are, are targeted. This parent has two children who attend other public schools in Oakland. He says it's concerning, coming on the heels of other gun-related incidents at schools. On September 28th, six people were shot and injured at King Estate School Complex. And on August 29th, a 12-year-old shot a 13-year-old at Madison Park Academy. It's heartbreaking, first of all. And it's, it's an outrage. Steve Peterson, a parent and head coach of Oakland Dynamites, a youth football team, experienced gun violence firsthand. On July 31st, his team was playing on the football field of Oakland Tech High School when a shooting injured three people. This city's always had a spirit of violence over it. But when they're shooting up schools, they're bringing guns to school, they're, they're shooting up football games, this is when it crossed the line. We're expecting you to do what the coach is telling you to do. On Friday nights, Peterson prepares these 10 and 11-year-old boys for their weekend football games and more. We're not supposed to give up a first down to this team, right? That's the lack of discipline. So that's why we own you guys every single day, every single day. A way to keep kids off the streets, a crucial step to violence prevention. We use the game of football to teach the boys discipline, honor, and respect. And we think if we can teach that within our community, at least we can lessen what's going on out here. Peterson says the gun recovered at Dewey Academy is a symptom of what's wrong. That's a problem, and we can't normalize that, and we can't be um, desensitized to what's going on. Peterson says it's important to teach kids early and what they learn on the field can translate to lessons about life. Alex? Yeah, it is so concerning to see so many guns being brought onto school campuses. Amber Lee reporting live for us tonight in Oakland. Thank you, Amber. Tomorrow